Hi everybody, welcome back. I have the long anticipated, totally waiting for the Geek Fuel XF. Um, this is the first edition, uh, volume one, I'm sorry, X, XP, EXP. Um, this is the volume one to their new, uh, quarterly subscription. So instead of doing $20 a month with shipping, $19.99 plus shipping, um, they're now doing $65 a month every three months with free shipping but to me you know that's just like twenty dollars a month plus one month shipping whatever you know but we will see if it stacks up to the every month ship every month because every month you got a t-shirt plus so many items um this every three months you get one t-shirt plus supposed to be more stuff um we'll see we will see so i got this today it actually came in the mail on saturday but since my post office only open an hour every saturday i did not get a chance to get to the post office in order to pick it up so i got it today and I did crack the seal on it. And this is what it looks like inside. Uh, it says Geek Fuel EXP and it says warning contains spoilers. And it says volume one down at the bottom. So let's just see what's inside here to begin with. We'll just take off the top. It has a Planet of the Apes pins. Oh, me in this light, guys. It has this little guy right here who's dark. The I'm gonna say he's the hunt leader, and then the other little guy right there who is George Taylor. And then this little pin up here that says ANSA. Adult collectible, not a toy. Collect all six. Here's the back. This one was the rare one we did not get. Okay. We're going to start off with the t-shirt because the t-shirt is the long-awaited supposed to be a dead fuel dead fool and it does say Merc with the cute little unicorn on it which I really like it says it is an EXP exclusive so let's see what it is box there oh pretty I can already tell you that they did not get my size right um, because it barely fits my boobs so there's what it looks like make sure all right that's what it looks like and it's actually my son's size so I'll probably save it and give it to him but I will be contacting geek fuel about that because that is not my size. It's supposed to come in my size because I paid for it, right? So, this you normally would have gotten in a regular monthly Geek Fuel. This and actually this because they always included a pin, but they included a one pin. So, I guess this is two months worth of a pin. So, what else do we got? We have, it says, Burger of the Day, the Geek Now or Fuel Ever Hold Your Peas Burger. Includes one officially licensed Bob's Burgers apron. Okay. Hope it don't look like that. 
Who makes the best burgers and loves nothing more than a delicious burger and a well-placed pun? The Belcher family, of course. Slip the paper over your neck and get to cooking with your favorite restaurant employees. Whether you're flipping food on the flat top or grilling out with a bounty of, veg of veggies, the Belchers are here to keep you clean and ready to entertain the masses. An eyeball looking at you. Another eyeball looking at you. Oh, that's kind of cute. Okay. There it is. Go all the way across and all the way there and the dude at the top. Okay. So. That dude's head on me for the rest of this video, huh? That is, it feels really nice. It's really big and roomy. Yes. So, works for me. Okay, so I guess this is kind of in place of another month's t-shirt. Okay. I'm fine with that. Now we have a Marvel, only available at Geek Fuel. Canvas Collection Limited Series. It says at the bottom. Okay. Um, so, a picture. Okay. What is this? Oh, Wolverine. I, again, if not a Wolverine fan. But, um, I'm sure one of my kids would really like it. It's like a comic book front. Because it has the UPC code there and everything. It has the let's see, comic right up here. A Marvel Comics Limited Series, number one. 60 cents. It is really nice. It's got a wooden frame. It has the... Um, canvas tacked onto the back. There's the hanger back there, under there. Um, so it is really nice. Very well um, put together. Quality. Nice. There it is. So, that's nice. Um, okay. Then we have a Cowabunga Pizza Cutter. And I do not have a knife because as we know, they don't allow me to have knives because they don't trust me when they're sleeping. <laughs> They'll stab you in your sleep. No, I'm just kidding. Or am I? Okay. Uh, got into that bad boy, didn't we? Cowabunga Pizza Cutter. Comfortable, non-slip grip, and dishwasher safe. Food safe, dishwasher safe, no microwave, and it is heat resistant up to 500 degrees Fahrenheit. It is a Geek Fuel exclusive. We are big Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle uh, fans in this house, so this is well received. I like it. Um, the packaging is really cute, if I can get into it. Um, let's see. Did everybody see my, uh, Instagram post? I did, my sister did come over and fix our paint for us. So it, it does look really pretty. I did paint two of my walls, or my sister painted two of my walls purple for me. Because she is a professional painter. That's what she's been doing for the last 10 years. Um, or, I'm sorry, 5 years. With my husband. It's and um, so she did come over and do hashtag girl power. And paint my uh, two of my walls. She's going to come back tomorrow. And put another coat on the one wall. 
and then start on the next wall so you guys stay tuned to see what color that's going to be go over and check out my um instagram posts and show my sister some love though because i really really appreciate her doing that for me um so then it has all of this in here okay so let's see it says cowabunga pizza cutter who doesn't love pizza i love pizza my fellow dudes and dudettes some major slice and dice action is in order for your next pizza pie no kitchen is complete without this pie sai sai unsheath and unleash your hunger while you chow down in the underground Remember, forgiveness is divine, but never pay full price for a late pizza. Cowabunga. Caution, not a toy. I will have to say, though, I live in the middle of nowhere, therefore, you don't get pizza delivery. You go pick it up, you drive it home for 45 minutes, and you get cold pizza. So, you get over it. That's what it looks like on the inside. Uh, Oh look, it's a piece of pizza. I might have to put that on my wall. That is really cute. Let's see? Okay. Oh wow, this is definitely an A for presentation. That is really cool. And it come it's got a velvet it's got a velvet bottom. And you know, always touch the sharp objects, huh? Oh wow, but ha this is the, handle, and it is a rubber, this appears plastic, but this down here is a silicone rubber feeling, so that is really cool, and then it has the little shell at the bottom even, wow, I thought of everything with that, that is really cool. I love the box. Check out the box. Even underneath the black little felt thingy they did. It says, save one pizza point expires 3-30-1990. That is so cool. Check it out. Right down there at the bottom. Kind of like a, um, you know, those box top for education, but it's a pizza. That is so cool, guys. I really like this. This is really neat. I, I'm liking that. Okay, so that would be in place, I would say, of another t-shirt, right? Okay. So now we have a Game of Thrones, The Winter is Here collection, Titans vinyl figures. Game of Thrones, a three inch vinyl figure inside. 13 to collect or 43 to collect, I can't tell. Some come with accessories. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13. So it must be 13. Okay, let's see what we get. <laughs> I love the Lego blind bags too. I have a good time with those two. Okay, empty box. And we have a container baggie. Let's see if they got a place for us to open it. Probably not because that would be too easy, right? Okay. <clears throat> I have no idea even who that is, so I will have to look on. Give me the box back. Oh my goodness. Okay. What is this thing? It is. I have no idea. I'm assuming. It doesn't look like any of these guys. Okay, so he's all blue, right? Those guys have all, you know, a black little outfit. And those all have a black little outfit. 
I'm so is he one of the one of the rare ones like the I got no idea because they have a white walker which he does not look like and they have a night king maybe he's the night king I know y'all are going to slay me in the comments because I have no idea. I've not watched Game of Thrones. I'm sorry. <coughs> but he's really cute. I'm going to stick him on my shelf when I get my shelf up. <laughs> he's cute. Okay. Now, the last item in here, and I swear to God, I have to be cut off with a stick. You guys, just wait. <sighs> Lego Star Wars. It is the Chronicles of the Force. Discover the story of the Lego Star Wars Galaxy. It has the Force Awakens exclusive minifigure. You guys wanna <coughs> see him in there? That's really cool. And it is a regular <coughs> book um, written by let's take a look oh okay so it's almost oh wow that is really cool guys so it has like the Tell us about the movie as and the um, facts about the uh, Lego figure as well. Like here it has um, the evolution of Darth Vader. They have um, right up there it talks about the um, how many sets and passengers and many figures and um, in the Imperial Shuttle Ultimate Collector Set. Wow. That's really cool, guys. I am excited. I am excited. This has a retail value of $16.99, which is cool. $20.99 Canadian. Um... Okay, so that's awesome. I'm trying to see what the guy looks like. It's kind of weird looking. I don't know what he looks like. What a weird little dude. Anyway, okay. So guys, that is it for $65. Now, I do not feel that you get anything more by doing it every three months. I think they get out of paying shipping, to be honest with you. Um, because you would normally get a t-shirt a pin, a figure, a figure of some sort, whether it be this size or a Funko or something of that nature, okay? Um, you would always get that, those, uh, a t-shirt, oh my god, a t-shirt, a pin, a figurine, and then, um, some kind of print like a um like a mini poster or something along those lines and then kind of an extra item so you normally get about five items every month for the 20 the 19.99 plus shipping so if you think about it we got the okay this would have could have counted as a t-shirt Okay, the t-shirt that doesn't fit me, 
the two pins. Okay, so this is two months, right? Uh, so we got the t-shirts and the pins for two months, but not three months. We didn't get a third pin or a third t-shirt type thing, like a pair of socks or a t-shirt or an apron or a towel or some kind of soft, what I would call a soft good. Okay. Um, we only got one little guy. Um, we got the one picture, poster, picture thing. We got the book and the pizza cup. And the, okay, so we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We got seven items. Eight if you want to count the pens as two because there's two in there. Um, that's not the same as what we were getting every month. Okay. Here is the inside. I'm going to do it this way. Okay. So the exclusive Deadpool t-shirt, the pizza cutter, the Lego Star Wars, the Wolverine pitcher, the Game of Thrones dude, the Bob's Burgers apron, and the Planet of the Apes pens. What does it say? Okay, the guy, the little dude that we got was the Titan vinyl figure exclusive Night King. He glow, he's a glow in the dark edition. Um, the box is the castle back oh castle black diorama is having the first white walker glowing from the corner of your room a little scary sure but you can rest easy knowing he can't actually reach out touch you and turn you into one of his own okay that's kind of cool um anyway so Will I get it again? I'm going to say it depends on what they do about the fact that the t-shirt was not my size. If I cannot personally wear that t-shirt, I will not buy this box again. I do not think it's fair that they offer my size, but yet they didn't send me my size. And I had to put it on. You know, my size is listed. So, that is kind of annoying. Um, so, if they don't fix that somehow, then I will not be repurchasing this box. Um, that being said, if they want, if they send me another t-shirt, you know, it doesn't really have to be Deadpool, whatever. They will send me a t-shirt of some kind in my size, or if they will credit me, um something on the box depending on how much if they credit me five bucks I'm gonna get real I can't even buy a t-shirt for five bucks so that won't be worth it but if they um, make it make it right then I will probably purchase it at least one more time just to kind of see what's in the next one um, but I'm not really for sure you know guys I don't know it kind of depends to be honest Oh, it shows you right there which who the, the Lego guy was. He is Un, Uncar's Brute. And you can only find him in this book. So that's pretty cool. Um, yeah, I'm not like, oh my god, I'm so impressed. That was the best box ever. 
It was so worth the $65 and, you know, like, I'm going to run right out and make sure that I am subscribed to this for next time. No, I'm not. Just not. I don't necessarily find the value in this box from it going from $25 a month and getting five items a month to $65 every three months and getting, what, eight items? So an eight, we got an extra three items for $40 more. I don't see it. I don't. I don't see it. I would much rather have paid $20, $25 a month and gotten a t-shirt every month. I would have much rather have had that. I'm disappointed. Okay. So, I'm going to end that here because I could rant probably on this all night long. Um, I'm really disappointed. We'll just leave it at that. So... Please check out my Instagram tomorrow and see um, my more progress on my room. My sister is going to come back over and paint another wall. And you guys can guess what color it's going to be because it will not be purple. Um, and then please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. It helps me grow. Um, I'm trying to get to the 1500 mark at this point. Um... I would greatly appreciate it if I could. And you guys, really, I thank you guys from the bottom of my heart for coming to watch my videos and listen to me talk. I, I greatly appreciate it. Um, and I understand that I have a few boxes coming. Nature Box, um, I did an order for my credit. Um, Bark Box, I did get it saying it's shipped. Snack Nation has been shipped. Um, I think that's it right now. Uh, so I cannot wait to see what I get in those. Um, so honestly guys, thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys later. Bye-bye.